When it comes to stucco repair, when it comes to stucco inspections, maybe you're online right now and you went through a home inspection and you had a problem with your stucco, the moisture has been found. I'm standing with Joe Flock. He's with US Stone and Stucco, one of the top stucco and stone companies throughout Bucks County, Lehigh County, Northampton County. You're here to educate us on why stucco fails and you recommend to the builder that they should have a stone and stucco applicator on the job. For what reason? Well, I think the biggest reason to have a stucco and a stone applicator doing the project all at one time is because you're going to have stone, you're going to have stucco, and you have these two dissimilar materials coming together. Who's responsible for these two different spots coming together? Well, I like to do the stucco, the stone, and do one big uniform coat. That way it seals everything in with the vapor barriers, the wire lath, the scratch coats to make sure that we have one big giant coat protecting your home. In this particular case behind us, a window's gonna need to be replaced because the window's failing. Tell me about the project we're on. So on this project, you're hired to come in, repair the, the stucco and the stone, but there's a moisture problem. So what I found was that the window is actually leaking itself. So what we're gonna do is come on this project. We're gonna remove that window, repair that window, put it back in with a proper uh, window sill flashing. That's gonna work coincide with the stucco and the stone that's below it. So there's a couple different things that we have to look at every time we do a repair to see where the problem's coming from. But there's a larger picture here and a larger project that needs to be addressed and our company can handle all of those projects. As I started to learn about the process, Joe shared this piece of flashing with me and showed me this piece of flashing. If I have a house being built, I'm going to want this piece of flashing. When people cut corners because of the price tag that's on this compared to the price tag that's on this for a couple cents, are you kidding me? Tell me about the problem that we actually see on this home many, many years later because the contractor that actually did the work did not put the proper flashing in place. So on this house we're doing here today, there was no water diverter put in between the siding and the roof to divert the water into the gutter. And instead, the water flashing was put in with a normal piece like this, and the water ran down the roof and directly behind the stucco and the stone system. So what we're gonna do is cut out an area at the roof line where the gutter meets. And we're gonna put this piece in directly up under the shingles and behind the siding. And what this is gonna do, this piece here is gonna divert the water right into the gutter where it's supposed to be going and away from the system. Joe, these repairs start with the home inspection. Tell me about that process and tell me how you fit into that process. So a homeowner is going to sell their home or they're concerned about their stucco or their stone. They come out and they hire an inspection company that performs stucco or stone inspections. So on a regular test here, to go out and see if your home has any moisture in it, we do an invasive test, but that just means that we're gonna drill two holes here, caulk and seal them with a matching caulk as close as possible to just go and make sure that the house is okay and we'll see what kind of moisture content there is. Anything roughly between 18% and down below is normal. Anything over 18% becomes a concern. They will come out and say, look, we need an intrusive test, but we'll come out and we'll cut out an area, like we took an area of the stone workout to see the damage, and we found damaged wood. So then we say, you know what, we have to go bigger and bigger and bigger until we get to the entire scope of the area that's damaged. Don't just have anyone out to the job. Make sure you have a professional that really understands these systems. If you're looking for stucco company, a stucco repair company, a Joe Flock, he'll be able to educate you on what you need to know. Thanks again, Joe. Hey, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Maybe you had a home inspection, the stucco has failed, you need help. You live in Lehigh County, Northampton County, Bucks County. Joe Flock, U.S. Stone and Stucco has been recognized as one of the best.